<clears throat> hey guys, Erica here, Scrap Diva 29. Welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day so far. It's such a beautiful summer this year. Um, I came on today because I have a few little hauls I'd like to share with you. I did a quick little run into Michael's yesterday. Didn't get a whole lot, but I just thought I would uh, share with you guys. Um, I did pick up this really pretty wired ribbon and it's in that alphabet section in Michael's and all of it's 70% off and I just thought this was so pretty and I figured I could cut it up or layer it or put it on a scrapbook or something so I picked this up and it was only I think three dollars so I got it in turquoise and then this um, beautiful purple you know I had to get the purple I love purple so isn't that pretty so I picked up these two spools and then I also um, I did pick up this little card set from in the dollar fifty section they did have an additional 25 percent off your sell items and regular price items so I thought that was a good deal and then I just picked up one of these I am forever always needing these kind of cases to store stuff in so I just picked one up and it was only four bucks so that's my little quick Michaels haul um, I did do a little online haul and I wanted to share with you these dies I was sharing them on Instagram the cards that I had made last night well some projects anyway I got these two dies by tape from tailored expressions I did pick them um, pick them up from eBay I that was the best deal that I found was on eBay so I bought them online and they're so super cute and this is what they look like I've already been playing with them and I've got my magnet and stored them I've got to get some more label maker tape so I can finish organizing my dies but um, that's what the die looks like and this is the first card that I made and I made this for one of the boys uh, friends who's having a party Saturday I just wanted to make a quick birthday card so I thought this would be cool for a boy and I just you know die cut all the pieces out I did add glossy accents to the middle of the this middle one the green sunglasses and then I did use an embossing folder uh, behind the sunglasses just gives it a little bit of dimension and then this is the inside and I did use one of the stamp pads that are like multicolored and that stamp that I used is from a Prima doll happy birthday stamp I just thought that was cute so that's my little quick card share I did make this as well and it's not it can be a card I hadn't finished I don't know what I'm gonna do it could be part of a scrapbook or a little mini something I don't know but I was just playing with it and I just wanted to share you can see I punched out the inlet inlays in gold glitter gold paper which makes it really shiny and sparkly it's just really really cool right <laughs> so super cute so I wanted to share that with you guys and oh and thank you to shoe princess one hey Bridget she is the one that found that die or not found it but she used it in a project she's such an enabler and um, when I saw her project I said oh yes definitely getting that die so anyway I um, found a local scrapbook store in my area and for all of you that live in the Atlanta area this scrapbook store is called Paper Dreams and I'm just gonna zoom in real quick so you guys can see her information and she is in Kennesaw and I'm not too far from Kennesaw I'm extremely excited to have a new local scrapbook store in my area we haven't had one in a while she's only been open for about five months so all of you all that are in the Atlanta area in this side of town looking for a new store to uh, buy from please check her out her name is Stephanie the owner she's a sweet lady we talked for about 30 minutes today so anyway this is what I picked up in her store and I love going to local scrapbook stores because you can always find the lines that you know the big box stores don't sell like Michaels and Hobby Lobby and you know they don't always carry you know this kind of stuff so anyway I picked up this Julie Nunningham a cling stamp and she is called Colette and she is super cute and I really want to paper piece her and I'm on a whole nautical beach thing thing right now that's what I've been buying so 
I wanted to get this and it says, hey there sailor. So super cute, I can't wait to play with this one. And then I also picked up the paper and this is the Julie Nutting um, Prima paper pad and it is a double sided pad with 30 sheets and it is, I'm trying to see what the name of it is. I can't really tell what it, the name of it is but it is a C theme, I'll do a flip through. This is quality cardstock. It's super thick. I really love thick quality cardstock. And bonus, it's double sided. Look at the cute little anchors. Super cute. I really can't wait to play with this and uh, make something. And then that just says set sail, ahoy, love. So cute. And it looks like there's three of each. And then look at these little tiny whales. Oh my gosh, super cute. So what a really fun pad. So I picked up the six by six pad. And then I also picked up some, I picked up three 12 by 12 sheets. And it's the same theme. Oh, Nautical Bliss. So this is the cut apart for the 12 by 12. And I just thought it was really cute. And then the back has really cute crabs. <clears throat> Excuse me crabs on the back and then this is the next one look at the cute little boats and flowers and the little anchors I just thought that was adorable and then we got a navy polka dot on the back of that and then this one right here is a striped kind of red and cream colored cardstock which is also part of that collection and that is on the back of this collection the flowers and the crabs let me turn it around so cute. So I'm going to have fun playing with that. I'm going to try to make something with that. And then I did pick up, she has some of the Fancy That My Mind's Eye um, chipboard and she had some dies and stickers and some of that collection in her store. So I already have the paper but I didn't have chipboard and I really need to make a wedding album for my cousin who is going to be getting married in August. So I picked this up in mind of making my little mini for her. So that was super cute. And it was a good price, only $5.99, so that's a good deal to me. And then she also um, pointed out these really cool Nuva crystal drops. I don't know if you guys have seen these. They're super adorable with the little shiny uh, diamonds on the top. I mean, who doesn't like bling, right? Super cute. But um, these are the colors that um, I got. I got gold and then this pink, and then I think this is some type of red color. And from what she told me, I've never played with them before, but she said that they dry very quickly. You can make your own enamel dots with them, or you can draw out different shapes and they dry, and then you can put them on your project. So I'm definitely going to play with these and um, see how they work and how I like them. So yeah, that is my haul for today. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day and getting lots of fun, crafty stuff done. I will talk with you later. Leave me a comment, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.